when I was at the Geological Survey of Canada, uh, I had the great fortune of working on a team that was doing really leading edge work here in Canada, um, and really globally leading edge work on understanding how uh, plate tectonics worked in the Precambrian period uh, during which the Canadian Shield was formed. And I'd say we made a couple of really fundamental discoveries, the first of their kind in the world, um, one of which in an area where I did my PhD uh, work, uh, working with a geological survey of Canada scientist uh, called Mark St. Um, we discovered the oldest oceanic crust on Earth, approximately two billion years old, that was sitting up on top of uh, the continent in northernmost Quebec. Um, work that we did from there has shown that um, uh, virtually all the attributes of uh, continental margin and its collision with another continent can be found there. Um, the work continues uh, today, but it was uh, really groundbreaking work and an exciting time to be um, walking on an area that had never been traversed by foot before in terms of geological mapping and, and discovering these things for the first time. Um, I then worked with a team of scientists from across Canada, um, Geological Survey of Canada, um, provincial colleagues from Manitoba and Saskatchewan, and university researchers in, in Canada and internationally. And there we looked at the same concepts in the area around Flin Flon and Snow Lake, Manitoba, and were able to demonstrate another type of ancient plate margin um, that um, not only gave rise to the uh, world class ore deposits there, but unique geology and, and we're able to uh, apply some of the techniques used in um, oil and gas exploration, seismic techniques, to image the deep parts of the continental crust um, and show that they had structural attributes similar to those that are found uh, in active plate margins. Mm -hmm.